why TBC was the deal. I'm going to leave this article in the description box. It's on BoxerScene.com. I've been hearing that Mayweather and Broner have been going back and forth in the media. But these, I mean, they always do this. Usually when I hear these things, I'm just like, yeah, okay, whatever. Um, but this one says, Broner to Mayweather, fuck you, stop talking about me. All right. Now, I guess a few days ago, Broner uh, went into a store, Walgreens or some shit, Walmart or something. And they were giving him change. And he said, I'm AB. I don't need change or something. He threw the change up. Just being Adrian Brown, like that type of behavior, I'm not going to speak on it too much. Young, you know, I'm, I'll am i be 36 this year, you know, so Broner, Broner's a lot younger than me. Um, just a young dude being a young dude, man. I mean, I got partners and homeboys, even myself back then, you know, do shit that you think about now and be like, man, why the hell did I do that back when I was 23, 24? You know, things of that nature. So to me it's just broner being broner whenever he's on instagram or these other little social media you know with his little video clips doing him it's just him being him really whether you think it's wrong or right um now i guess mayweather came out and he responded to that and he responded to some other thing now let me just read some quotes from this and i'm gonna just talk about it. he says mayweather says by the time i was his age i was a much bigger star i fought a lot better competition than he's fought, you know, not knocking him, you know, because he can only fight who they put in front of him. I mean, his two biggest fights were against Sean Porter and Adana, right? And he came up short. I think he won the war title like what they say three or four times. I know he won one against Paul Malignaggi, but I don't know who else he won a title from. <laughs> so then Broner comes back. You know that 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 pissed him off. And, and Floyd, the type of dude, man, where he can just kill you with kindness sometimes. He ain't got to come out and you know be boisterous and you know what I mean, uh, outlandish and say crazy shit. He can just kill you with kindness and kill you with facts sometimes, even if it's facts you don't want to hear. See, now that's funny. Now that that's a funny thing to me, man. Because when I'm breaking down Broner's resume and people tell me, oh, he's a four weight division. And then when I break it down and say, man, come on, he ain't no really no four division weight champion. And, you know, break it down. I'm a hater. But then when when, when Floyd do it and maybe because it's Floyd, obviously, I'm not Floyd Mayweather. He's the boxer. I'm just a fan, you know. But then when Floyd talks about it, I see people under the comments saying, yeah, that's real shit. And yeah, 100 and all, you know, and got the fist emoji and all this. It's like, well, damn. When I say some shit like that, I'm a hater. Floyd says it, you know, right on, you know. So Floyd just agreed with a lot of us boxing fans. All that four weight division shit from Broner. Technically, yeah, but come on, man. Um, so then he responded to that. Broner responded saying, uh, Floyd talking about me again. Not once, but this has happened on multiple occasions. This goes back to what I said. Real niggas don't do this type of shit, bro. You said want me to do all this good shit and then when you do an interview you talk about me. It's like how real is that? What type of nigga is you? Uh he's a type of nigga that you wanna be. <laughs> that you copying your whole swag and persona from, okay? I don't give a fuck what you did, nigga. Whether it was real or not. Anytime you was in those lawsuits, nigga with your baby mama they said you hitting her with <laughs> they said you hit and again i'm not advocating domestic violence man but it's just listening to this dude or reading what he said is just funny to me but he says uh yeah with your baby mama um and they say you were hitting her with those three pieces like you fighting miguel Cotto. i don't get into that i don't say he should have did this or should have did that you know what i'm saying fuck all that my nigga didn't do that i don't say floyd hurting himself he, re he responded to floyd saying that broner was hurting himself by you know uh pretty much just throwing away his money and making decisions and not being rational with his decision making about his money okay then he says uh you was the same nigga for four or five years ago burning money in the club come on bro you're 39 so you were 34 35 at the time you burning money in the club and I didn't say anything about that. That motivated me that one day I would have enough money to throw some change at Walmart. I didn't think that would ruffle your feathers, bro. Come on, stop talking bad about me, bro. We are not in the same tax bracket. I'm starting to feel like I'm a threat to you, big bro. I don't like that, especially when you got my number. 
But the thing with Broner has to understand is he promotes Ashley Theo Payne. He wants his fighter to win this fight. Sometimes it doesn't seem like Broner knows when to let Big Bro and that's my bro and that's my nigga and all that. It's like he don't know when to let that shit go sometimes. Like, at least for this time period, let's not be friends. I'm not saying don't ever be the man friend or don't, you know, but just for these little few months, can you just not be friends? Like, and maybe they are, maybe this is their way of showing that, hey, we're not friends right now by talking shit, but you need to be worrying about Ashley Theo Payne. Um, okay, so what else did, did he say? He says, uh, he says, I think that you are a good hearted nigga and you might want to help somebody, but you will help somebody so they might do good enough. They might do great, but you don't want him to do better than you. And I've heard a lot of people say that. I don't hang around Floyd Mayweather. I don't know if Floyd doesn't want people around him to do better than him. What 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 I will say if I I don't know how you judge if somebody's doing better than Floyd. If you mean by uh, monetary success, it's going to be very hard unless your name is like Al Heyman or you know somebody like that that's going to be doing better than Floyd if you're around him. Maybe Sam. I, well, I don't know how much these dudes have, but any other fighters that's around Floyd, you can't really say that Floyd don't want those guys to do better than him. I mean, Floyd's damn near a fucking billionaire and nobody has even came close, whether they're around Floyd or they're right up under Floyd has came close to getting those type of numbers. Last guy that I remember that came close to those type of numbers, Mike Tyson, Oscar De La Hoya, guys like that. And they were not under Mayweather's uh, eye or tutelage or in his camp. So, to me, Broner, man, should just do what he do and don't respond to Floyd. But I know it's hard, you know, especially in the day of social media. And it's, you know, it's 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 hard to hold back from uh, pressing the send button. <laughs> you know what I mean? Stop pressing the send button, Adrian. Just, I think you should focus on Ashley Theo Payne. But then again, I'm just a guy behind my computer. Adrian Broner's the, uh, what is this, the four weight division champion and all this shit. So... He's going to do what he wants to do. I think he's going to attack Theo Payne, though. But um, I don't know, man. AB seems like the type of dude that will probably be in there with Theo Payne. And he'll look out into the crowd at Floyd and try to stick his tongue out or something. And, and sh you know, in a uh, showboat, he might get caught with something, man. But I got him winning this fight. Him and Floyd just doing what they do. Just going back and forth talking shit doesn't surprise me. Five months from now, you can probably see them pool aside somewhere, drinking Mai Tais, chilling or something, man. Who knows? You know, but I thought this was just funny. Broner, Floyd going at it, man. Uh, shit's funny to me, man. I know this shit's just funny to me. YTBC, I'm out.